For those of you who are taking communicative abilities in English this fall 2022 semester, I want to give you some brief instructions, an overview uh, as to our first test that we're going to do today, August 31st. The first thing is, if you haven't done so already, is to create an account in Flipgrid. Make sure that you use your Office 365 account. So you'll use your username and password that you use to access Microsoft 365 and also the virtual classroom when creating your account in Flipgrid. I've included a link here in the instructions, so feel free to access this. This link will take you to the group that will be uh, where we'll be working uh, throughout the semester as it relates to Flipgrid activities. Okay, so there's a group and then within a group, they, we have different topics. They refer to them as topics or activities that we'll be doing. So the link that I've provided here in RimNote will take you to the Flipgrid group. I also have the same link in the virtual classroom. At the very top in the general section, I have a link that will also take you to the Flipgrid group. Uh, now that you have had three weeks working together with some of your classmates, I'd like for you to prepare a five-minute discussion for this uh, activity. The five-minute discussion, I would ask that you include the following. The first half of your five-minute discussion should be simply an introduction to yourself. Share something that you haven't mentioned to any of your classmates. So, so try to uh, provide something that maybe you don't often talk about. Maybe you've never spoken about this with your classmates. Um, and uh, this is what I'd like you to try to include in your introduction. So again, you can give a general overview of who you are, but try to include as <clears throat> much information as possible that might be new to some of your classmates. The second half of the activity, I would like for you to mention something uh, about two or more of your classmates, something that they told you in the past uh, that relates to them as a person. Maybe it's something that they're interested in, maybe a personal experience, uh, something that you found interesting, something that stands out that makes them interesting. This is something that you can include here in the latter half of <clears throat> your five-minute discussion. Finally, I'd ask that you respond to two of your classmates and try to choose classmates, try to respond to your classmates who have not received two responses already. The idea here being that everyone receives two responses and the classmates that you respond to do not have to be, in fact, they probably won't be the classmates that you spoke about, okay? So it can be any two classmates uh, preferably someone that you interact with less, okay? Preferably just to kind of network a little bit and uh, maybe seek out those classmates that maybe you don't have a lot of opportunities uh, to speak with, okay? So this is going to be our first task for today, August 31st. I'll give you further instructions on what we'll do in the second activity. If you have any questions uh, regarding this activity that I've explained here, of course, uh, let me know.